Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, my name is Lauren. If you like the content, then I would love for you to subscribe. To all my returning subscribers, you know this already because I tell you every time, but honestly, you guys are the best, you're awesome, and I truly appreciate all your support. Today's video is going to be um, a comparison between two different sunglasses. I just got a new pair of Sunnies by Saint Laurent, I believe that's how you pronounce it. Um, and I'm gonna show you a dupe that I have from Amazon that were $20 Canadian. So you can decide what you wanna do. Let me know what you think about these new sunglasses I'm gonna show you. I'm a little bit, I'm a little like on the fence with them. I actually just ordered another pair from Farfetch, which I think are gonna be the ones I'm gonna keep. Um, so watch out for an upcoming video. But these are the sunglasses here. So this is the case that they came in and it just says the branding there. The thing when you buy designer goods and obviously like, you know, I love luxury is that it comes with all these bells and whistles. So um, like the Amazon pair I'll show you later, it came with like a little kind of like cheapy cloth, um, um, cloth kind of dust bag that like <laughs> doesn't protect the sunglasses at all. So these come with like the hard case. So I got these off Essence and they were regular $485 but on sale for $320 and it's only for people that can access the private sale. There is a public sale but there's also a private sale so if you I guess spend a certain amount um, sort of annually on Essence and you're invited to like their private sale so you might not see this for the $320 Canadian on the Essence site if you are looking for it. But Anyway, um, it just says Saint Laurent inside there, and then this part is magnetic. Ignore that noise, that is my dryer. It, I don't know how to work this dryer in this new place, it's really annoying. Um, and then something I didn't know, because I pulled it out and I was like, what the heck, like why is it in this bag, is this real, whatever. Um, it does have the authenticity card, and then it also has obviously like the little, sunglass white that says Saint Laurent and then the skew for Essence. So um, this was weird though, because then it says here, if you can see the branding, it says Caring, I believe it is, um, or Caring Eyewear. And I thought, what the heck is that? So I actually Googled it. And so this company makes a lot of the different um, sunglasses for luxury brands. So so Caring actually makes sunglasses for like Chloe, Balenciaga, Gucci, Cartier, um, Saint Laurent, all these different houses like Bottega. So um, yeah, came with this bag. So I feel like if you went to the optical to buy these or to like a store and actually bought it, they would probably take this out and you wouldn't actually see like this bag there like that. But just note, it came with that and then sort of like a little bit of history on the brand itself. And then these are the sunglasses. So they're beautiful. They're honestly stunning and gorgeous. These are them here. Let me close that up. So they are like a very pronounced cat eye. You can see like they're super, and try not to get the glare from the camera, but they're super angular, as you can kind of see there. They are completely sort of, now you can see my filming, they are like all black and shiny. Part of the design that I really like, that I make, think makes these sunglasses unique, is that this part here sticks out. You can kind of see how it kind of curves up, so from the side, it sort of extends there. I just think that's a little bit different. Um, and I like that touch. I really like the um, very thin arms too. I think if they were thicker, it might make this look a little bit chunkier just because this is very extended. But I mean, that's just personal preference. Let me show you what these look like on. Look, look at these sunglasses. They are just so cool. Um, I feel like it's very my style. I like the cat eye and sort of like this very elongated sort of style of it. Um, I feel like all black outfit, gold jewelry, or you could be wearing sweatpants with these sunglasses and you're gonna look automatically cooler. So this is what they look like. And then again, from the side, and please ignore if you see my, I'm having like a little bit of eczema on my neck, but I feel like they suit my face really well and they don't slide down um, like, some sunglasses really slide down. They slide down a little bit. I could probably go to an optical and get it adjusted slightly in the back, but I feel like these fit my face shape 
fairly well so i just love these i um i've heard a lot about the i think they are the ones that heart evangelista wore and they are the saint laurent 276s the new waves it's very similar to this those ones are really popular they have those on sale too but i opted for these ones just because i like the really sort of elongated like i said cat eye um but these are also similar to those ones, the 276s, the new wave ones that are, like I said, they've been like sold out and they got really popular. Um, so these are them here. And now I'm gonna show you the Amazon dupes because honestly, when I first pulled these out of the package and I looked at them, I'm like, these look like the sunglasses I already have. Um, and they do. Like me looking at these right now, these look so similar to the sunglasses I have. So let me show you. I hope they're clean. They were in my car. These are the Amazon ones. And so I have had these now for, I got them last year. So I've had them for a year. I get compliments all the time on these sunglasses. Like if I go through a drive through um, and people see me wearing them, they're like, I like your sunglasses. Where did you get them? In all my posts when I'm wearing them, people are like, where did you get your sunglasses? And I'm always like, oh, they were $20 from Amazon. So. These are them here, and like I said, let me put the Saint Laurent side by side so you can see there's a little bit of a difference. Like the bridge of the nose part here, it's um, thinner. And obviously the cat eye, this one angles more up. So this was is more sort of straight across, whereas this one here I feel like angles up. But they are pretty close especially when I put them on. So let me put this pair on for you. Right? Like, <laughs> I feel like these are also so cool. And they were $20. And they are protecting my eyes from the sun. So, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like they're too similar for me to keep. And just knowing that this was $20 and these are like $320 and I got these on sale. So obviously there are differences in quality. Even just holding it, I can tell the difference. <laughs> Which is funny because they're both made from acetate, um, the same materials, you can tell the difference. And I feel like that's the same with sort of all luxury goods. So um, uh, one thing I noticed for sure with these ones is I've had them now for a year, but even when I first got them, the lenses are pretty thin and cheap and they kind of have a little bit of wiggle. Like they're not completely in their sort of flush. So that's something, whereas these ones with the Saint Laurent, I mean, like there's no, there's no wiggle. I don't want to touch them too much, right? Um, you can tell even with just like the hardware and the hardware on this one. Like this one, when you hold it, it just closes like that. It just, this one, you have to close nicely. You know what I mean? So there are differences. You're paying $20 for these, so they sort of have like the thicker, kind of chunkier type of arm on the side where again, I said this one is thinner. So um, I kind of explained it the same way if I were to buy a handbag and that's why I typically buy luxury handbags because usually the quality is better. Not always, but usually. So I can definitely tell that the quality on these are better, like even the hardware. So there's the hardware on the Saint Laurent one, you can see the screws and everything there. And let me quickly show you on my, oh, my $20 one. See that screw? Like, you just know that this isn't really, really meant to last probably as long. But, I mean, it's $20, so you can get a new one if you break it. I really liked these ones from Amazon so much that I um, picked up another pair last year. Um, kind of after and these ones are the tortoise shell as you can kind of see and they have like a gray Type of lens on the inside, but again same kind of thing a little bit cheapy, but I mean I like them <laughs> I think that these ones are really cool I like to wear these ones when I'm wearing sort of all white I find that the black tends to go really well when I'm wearing all black kind of like this and then this one goes when I'm wearing kind of white or lighter kind of colored clothes. So let me know what you think. Uh, honestly, 
Now even just putting them side by side and trying them on and looking in the viewfinder, I think they're a little bit too similar. Like I said, I did order another pair of sunglasses by Saint Laurent um, from Farfetch and they are new season and on the Saint Laurent website on Essence and everything, they're like $450 and I paid $260 with taxes and shipping and duties and everything from Farfetch, that's why I like Farfetch. Um, so I will show you those when I get them, but I'll put these on one last time. I honestly think they're cool. <sighs> they're really cool, but I don't think I can justify the price just knowing that they're so similar to these. Like I know that these are better, but from far away, I feel like I can kind of get away with the Amazon pair. Right. I don't know. Let me know what you think. Um, and if you think I should keep these or if you think I should just go with the Amazon dupe sort of down below, I will leave both um, pairs of info down in the description box in case you're interested in them. And again, thank you so much for all the love and support and for watching this video. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.